coming to you from CES 2012. Lots of gadgets here, and we've come across Optima Technologies. They're here showing off some incredibly small projectors for projecting images up on walls, screens, so on and so forth. If you remember back into the 80s and 90s, if you wanted a projector, you had to lug around a 200-pound thing with you and connect it to your computer. Well, those days are over. Standing with me is John Grodem, he's Senior Director of Product Marketing with Optima. So why don't you tell us, John, a little bit about the different products that you're showing off here at CES. Sure, David, thank you. Well, actually, we're announcing two brand new models that have never been seen anywhere. First one is that I'll start with is what we're calling our ML300. It's a 300 lumen projector. Um, basically, it's right about a pound in weight. And you know, I'm shooting it on this image on the screen over here to the, uh, to the right. Um, you know, you were talking about size, and size has, has changed so much. And size matters. Size does matter, and what, particularly when you're, you know, you're carrying a couple, you know, five, what, five, six, seven pound notebook, and now I got to carry a seven, eight pound projector. It's kind of hard. But the whole idea here is with LEDs, and this is all LED stuff. We've been able to get a lot smaller, a lot more energy efficient. Which in a second I'll show you another one of those sort of how that kind of comes into play. But we're also able to do some more things with it. So for example, the ML300. You know, it's, it's a 300 lumen projector. May not sound like a big number, but you know, when you're looking at an image in a presentation, in a, you know, and it could be, a, a, say it's a traveling salesperson, or it's a medical, or something like that, you don't need a whole lot of distance, maybe. It's a small group type projector, and that's one of the ways to think about it. So we've added HDMI to this. We've added, um, you know, USB, SD card, so take all of your content off of your notebook and just get it on here any way you want. Now the other nice thing is on the back. Well, when you say take your content off, does that mean I could have like a PowerPoint on the USB thumb yes. drive and it will know how Plug to read that? Straight in and it'll read your PowerPoint, your PDF file, all that kind of stuff. The other thing we've done, and you notice on the back here there's a little white dongle sticking off, that's Wi-Fi. We can, it's wirelessly enabled to take this in the USB slot and then go ahead and send your content straight over from a notebook. And we actually have a notebook behind me to the right here that is streaming the content straight over to this right now. So do you need a special software that you make that goes on the notebook to broadcast that? Um, it is, no, it's standard Wi-Fi and the dongle to do it all. So this will recognize it and all the magic is actually on the device. Okay. okay. All right, so that's 300 lumens. And how much is that? So that's going to come out at 499 price point and it'll be shipping in the next couple of weeks. All right, okay. now I got this other little guy here. So this is what we call our PK320, uh, also just being announced. And it's, 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 it's uh, on power, on AC, it's 100 lumens. Okay. Now, this has also got a built-in battery to it, and we were talking about energy efficiency a second ago. That's what LEDs allow us to do. So when I unplug it here, it's going to go dim while it resynchronizes, but now it's coming in and out at 25 lumens. So I've got power, both power modes. I can take it anywhere. Think of this one, you know, think of this as more your companion. Put it in your pocket, take it anywhere. It's only about four ounces in weight. Five ounces, slide in your pocket, take it anywhere you want. Any kind of a group thing. And it's also shooting on this little portfolio kind of screen and you got the pockets that'll all fit into this and you're done. Another new product. Do you sell the portfolio with it or yeah, it's yeah, separate? It's an extra purchase, but and then, uh, uh, an extra purchase, but there's a screen built in right here and this is screen material and we're all done. So this is like, like 70 bucks. Now can you hook your uh, thumb drive up to that and download your content to that as well? Actually you can, yeah. We so can you do don't need a computer, you just take right. that on the road with take you? on the road and you're done. Yeah, it, absolutely. All right, so uh, how much is that guy? This will be at 449, um, so about $50 less. Uh, What's the name of that one? So this is, again, PK320 from Optima. All right, and then uh, this is like, hard to say it, this is the big kahuna of the bunch, <laughs> but it's it's like, you know, one-tenth of the size of the old projectors, you know, that, that used to be made by, you know, all the big guys like Epson and so on. So uh, what's this? Well, this is a product we started shipping about two months ago. We call this the ML500. And so, call it the big brother to the to the 300 here. This is shooting out at out at about 500 lumens of, of light output. Um, you know, you, where, where I'm actually connecting to tonight is my iPad, and I'm just using the Keynote app and just sending you know the, the, a straight PowerPoint presentation over. It's got all the features of the other guys. It's just a little bigger form factor to get a little brighter. Right. Okay. And how much is this one? Um, 599. So it's not too far apart. No, hundred dollars more from the the 300 lumen version. Right. And I see you've got a remote control here. Yes. So what does the remote control do? Um, all of your standard features can be controlled off of this. So whether it's power or it's your source selections or I want to play Material Native or do whatever I want, it's all right off of that. Okay. So uh, just going back through them, yeah. what's the biggest image that the big guy here, the 500 yeah. lumen device, can display? You know, I've seen it 70, 80 inches in a semi-darkened conference room without a problem. Like um, on a wall. Like on a wall. wall. Yeah. Now. This is behind us is a yellow wall that's going to skew the colors pretty bad. But if you know if you if you indulge me and let me shoot it at the wall, you know there I am shooting on a nice ugly yellow wall, right? Not a nice screen. And this is a pretty bright environment. So just to get a feel for how big you can go. 
No, well, this is important because when you talk about lumens, you, what we're talking about is how brilliant will the image be on the wall right. given the amount of ambient light that's yes. in the room. Right? Yes, exactly right. And the, the, the more lumens, the brighter you can overcome. But again, that was shooting on a yellow wall, and I and then you know, and, and it didn't just it didn't blow the brightness out on it. What was blowing it out was more the yellow of the wall, not the white of the wall. How big an image can we get with the 300 lumen? Um, you know, I would go probably you know if, if we could do say a 75 to 100 with this, that, you know, you're talking 50 to 70. And then what about with this little fella? This guy's real personal. I would say up to about 30. 30, but yeah. ideally in a but portfolio yeah. like right. this. On something like this, and that's your nice brightness. You know, and you can do it battery mode or power mode with that. And how much is the little portfolio for those who want to know? $79 for this. All and right. it's, it's a nice kind of leather feeling thing, and you know, take it with you. Be proud of it, right? Okay, well, John Grodham, have a good show here at Great. CES. Thank you, Dave. Appreciate it.